the most wonderful day. My darling Olive, today was a wonderful day. I made breakfast. You know how much I love toast. I wash the dishes. Wash, wash, wash. I only broke one, two, all right, three, okay, five, but that's it, five dishes. That must be my piano teacher, Mrs. Danziger. I didn't practice. Hello, Mrs. Danziger. Hello, Myra. Let's get to it. I have to do this for a living. She is terrible. Hmm. I think I'm getting the hang of it. When will this torture end? Help. After my piano lesson, I went to my studio to paint. I have many paintings to do, and I have to work very quickly. I looked at my books and got lots of ideas. Painting is exhausting. It's good to take a nap. I can dream really good dreams. Sometimes the dreams become paintings. Oops, I forgot. I had one more dream to dream. That was a lot of work. I decided to go for a walk in the park. I love to walk in the park, to look at trees and leaves, to watch people and look at more trees, to look and look and look. I went to the zoo to look at the penguins. They really know how to hop. Hop, hop, hop. Oh well, I went to Grand Central Station it is so grand. People come and go. So many people saying hello and goodbye, running, running everywhere. Goodbye, everybody. I felt a little hungry, so I made a beautiful pink cake with raspberries on top. Yay! You know what's a really good game? Rolling 12 clementines down the hall. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. That was truly indubitably, without question, the most wonderful day. Love, M. It's time to mail my letter. I'm gonna give it to mailman Augie. Thank you very much. Thank you, mailman Augie, you're very, very nice. Today was a wonderful, 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 wonderful day. <laughs>